Hello everybody, today is Tuesday the 5th of April and um, it is afternoon, I just had a nap. Um, still not in the routine of filming again. I am still worried about my cheek. It still does it, um, swells up and goes down. I'm taking painkillers and anti-inflammation things. Also pineapple extract, um, which helps too. And then it gets better and then I tell somebody it's better and I'm very happy about it and then it gets worse again. So my conclusion is one shouldn't say one's better because then uh, it just gets worse next moment. Because that's what what's happening here all the time. I'm playing a game, a farm will, and um, they have events all the time. So I can play that all day long. It's uh, still hard to make cards. I'm trying to make money because I have um, some birds walking around and they don't have a home. And this is the cheapest way to make money. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not a good way. But they, they are walking around and they don't have a home and I need to buy something for 5,000 bucks. And I only have 2,700. So I'm working on that. <laughs> also, I've started... Um, Easter Easter things. I want to make those boxes for my family. Um, you can see it has a cloud thingy. It's not finished. I don't know how it will look when it's finished, but I'm taking you along with that. They're called scalloped treat boxes. They are from Lawn Fawn. And uh, it looks like this. This is the die which cuts out a panel and you need two of those and the rest I'm trying to film. Um, my cats want to go outside but not without me and I don't want to. I was also sick last week because um, it got colder again and uh, this is also another thing with the chronic fatigue syndrome and also I've seen documentaries about it. It's very in now, also with the long-term COVID, um, COVID um, things. When you have had it and don't get over it, you have the chronic fatigue syndrome or something. And uh, now it gets more popular, even though it's known for a long time. I've heard first of that um, chronic fatigue syndrome through Golden Girls. Because Dorothy had it and it was in the show because the one who wrote it... Harris, Susan Harris had it and um, it is an odyssey when you have something invisible and also when you're quite cheery for others and uh, nobody ever believes that you are not well and uh, that's very annoying, it's super bad and uh, <laughs> she wrote that into her show and I loved, I loved those episodes because it was also with doctors who send you away because it's just something, do something nice, get a haircut, um, just um, pull yourself together or something and in the end it's not what it's about um, and she has her revenge moment in a restaurant um, Dorothy and then his the doctor's wife doesn't side with him but with Dorothy <laughs> it's quite nice to hear that to see that <laughs> oh, that was that um, ah look at that my flowers are already blooming again I'm going to get, get them back um, I, I'm not doing a lot. I'm not doing Easter cards other than those four boxes uh, because I don't get it done. I have a new light thingy. I can put my cell phone on here and then I can film uh, chocolate no. I can film what I have underneath and um, I think that's gonna be better for the crafting because I had this little tripod when I crafted and I had to grab around it when I colored and it was very annoying and I do anything to show my nerves to give my nerves some I don't know holidays <laughs> um, I don't know I think there will be more to talk about but I don't really know Ayatina I'm sorry I, I, I I'm not good with answering to the comments I do have a um, dishwasher it's broken and no I didn't get it fixed because I would I would want to have my flat a bit cleaner 
and I also cannot be bothered in organizing it, calling I don't know who, and get something over somebody over here. I kind of like doing them <clears throat> uh, when I can do them. The dishes, uh, it's always a, um, a a point to celebrate when I can do it, and uh, yeah. Another thing is when you have dishwasher and are just one person. Then you fill it over a few days and you don't know what you have clean and what is in the dishwasher. When you do it by hand, you, you see it either it's not clean and on the counter or it's not there and then it should be clean in the cupboard or something. So I kind of like doing that. <laughs> if only I could. <laughs> yeah, so that's that for now. <laughs> also, I'm watching, sometimes I watch... Uh, this lady, she is, um, she has 10 kids, six are adopted and four, four, I don't, four own ones, I'm sorry, I don't know how to say that. And she makes breakfast in the morning and lunch preparation and stuff at five in the morning and she does that for, for yeah, her kids and it's quite um, motivating to do that too. So I can advise that, advise that, recommend that to watch that. She's, Doherty dozen. D O U G H E R T Y dozen there. And um, it's quite. She's just uh, doing that in the morning. Now she makes um, sandwiches for all her 10 kids and uh, other things. And yeah. Now I'm, I'm having an early dinner. This is a noodle salad with um, leftover noodles, corn, uh, pickles onions and garlic and here I have still have some meat because I ordered a kebab on Saturday today's Tuesday and it was I think it was the wrong delivery I got the mega XL thingy the double double the size and I took a lot of meat out of it and since Saturday I'm eating that <laughs> so that's the leftover from it. I had the whole thingy full with uh, meat out of the one kebab I ordered so and good and here we go with uh, um, the making of something. Uh, I already cut those things out, the scalloped treat box. And I have a stencil from Lawn Fawn or MFT. And I have the Distress Oxide salvaged patina. And I'm just trying to ink blend the sky here. And I put them next to each other because it's gonna be the box uh, the, the two walls of the box and they are following one of one another <laughs> and no ink on the on the tab to glue together it's very hard to talk i'm i'm sick so i <laughs> don't know how to anyway it's very windy over here <clears throat> and i have a big headache all day and yesterday already and here it does have score lines from the dye thingy but they it's very very thick paper and I just went all, all over all the lines again with my little uh, score pal and uh, a uh, score thingy. And then I fold them. And I do the same with the second one. I actually show that. Okay, here we go. I'm just trying to find um, the lines. Preparing the things to be stuck together with double-sided tape or score tape and just on those flaps on each side on each of the panels and there's something sticking out I'm going to cut that off and the rest I will do with glue because glue gives me more time to then um, put it in place and it doesn't stick immediately. So here's the bottom part. And then I put the sides up of the other thingy a bit to make sure that the shape or with this thingy that it I can just put it towards those walls. It's very hard to explain stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. And then I um, 
press it together. And now I do all of the four tabs, one by one. Just try to line up those edges. And this one didn't go well, but the score tape um, sticks so good, so I cannot take it apart again. That's why I took glue for the bottom part. And the last one. So. And those letters spell Happy Easter. I cut those out before. Um, this is now the ink blending of the decoration for on top of the box, outside the box. With um, It's a different ink now, it's worse or fine. I like it very much. And um, yeah, I'm just ink blending the top of the grass things. I'm just showing you one. I did that about eight times or six. I don't know, made three boxes, one I had already. Uh, then I, I I layered them and I didn't want to glue it on the box so I glued it together before I marked how far down the one thingy goes and also had to refill my glue, uh, switch my glue tube because the other one was broken. And um, there we go with the glue and put it together and later on I cut off the under part. Um, yeah, the, there it's all cut off already and I've prepared more and I just put it on, bend it so I know how far I have to put the glue and also it's already a bit scored those were bent then it's easier because you cannot bend it well over a corner when it's already on. Yeah, and so on. <laughs> Here I tipped out the letters for onto the box. They should spell Frohe Ostern, which is Happy Easter. And uh, well, that was very quick now. I didn't have all the letters anymore. Had to look for them. And then I tried to fit them on the box. It's very narrow, so they are on purpose hanging over the edges. And I do like how it looks, um, but my first plan would have been to have them plain on the, on the thingy. But now they're just... Um, yeah, very crooked and over the edges so that they fit. Today is Thursday the 7th of April and I did not get further but I glued all of the um, Frohe Ostern on each of them. I have four. One is blue, one is pink, yellow, I don't know which one I showed, and orange. And I don't get further, I want to decorate it a bit but I don't know how. <laughs> Uh, and I am always a bit on the sickish side. It got colder again and I got a cold and I'm not so fit. That's why I don't go further and I didn't film any more. Now I'm trying to do something in the kitchen. Get that a bit cleaner and cook something. Uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> and um, I'm gonna finish this vlog up, 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 off. I don't know, I lost my English. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next one.